Frankie, we are seriously getting behind on our brass sorting. Yeah, you really are. Wait a second, I thought this was a team effort. <laughs> it is, I was just joking. <laughs> I wanted to put the blame on somebody. Yeah. Um, so guys, you'll know that uh, from our shooting videos, you've seen us, uh, we always take time at the end to pick up brass, mm -hmm. and if we're lucky, the people before us will have left it because more gold. Uh, more gold, as we call it. Guys, yeah. this is free money right here, it the really brass. Is. Let's make this a bit of a public service announcement yeah, we really too. Should. Even though that, like, you know, it would be more for us if you leave right. it. Yeah. Guys, you should be picking up your brass. Your yeah, spent you brass, really should. Even if you don't reload. Mm -hmm. You really this should. This is the most expensive component of ammunition, is well, the brass shells. It conserves the earth. <laughs> <laughs> it's our own form of recycling, it right? It is our own yeah. form of recycling. This is These the most expensive do component. Do not biodegrade. <laughs> no, they don't. Surprisingly not. No, you it's, can just let them It's shocking, sit. probably, to yes. a lot of people. So this, this guy's... It's the most expensive component. Even if you don't reload, it is mm -hmm. worth money. But I'm saying maybe one day you will reload. Yeah. That's one thing to consider, Frankie. Or you can trade it. You can trade it. You can mm -hmm. sell these bags. You yeah. know, not for a ton of money. People but People will buy it. You know, maybe maybe you could sell this for a box of the ammo. You know. So. Yeah, possibly. I yeah. don't know. You get enough work. of it. Yep. Right. Mm -hmm. So uh, another thing to consider too. There may be a time. When this stuff is really hard to get. Yeah, that's true. You know, who knows? Yeah. We, we, you have to weather these political ups and downs that uh -huh. we see with our with our that's hobby, true. with our sport, you know? And, yeah, you just got to be ready for uh -huh. who knows what's coming. So, I, yep. I'm saying it's a good idea to pick it up, even if you don't reload yeah. for it. I agree. But uh, get into reloading anyway. Stop buying cases of ammo and, and instead, next yeah. time, maybe just buy your start own reloading. Start with something. Reloading you know, start setup, with yeah. nine or... Yeah, 45 two, or two, whatever three. you shoot. Yeah, yeah, yeah absolutely. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, we reload for 9 and 223, but we pick up everything, right? right. But we need to sort it, okay? Yeah. So we've done this by hand before, and it is an absolute pain, right? Yeah. Very and we had to tedious. think to ourselves, there has to be an easier way. There's got to be a better <laughs> way, Frankie. Yeah, it's so there was. It's an infomercial. Yeah. <laughs> we picked this up. Uh, Here you go. Yeah, last year. It's Guys, this is the... Um, well, there's not really a name for it, but it's the shell sorter from MidwayUSA.com. Right. Yes. There's a pug back there yeah, making some rooting. noise, rooting around. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, from MidwayUSA.com, you get these yep. three plastic buckets, and they've got little slots in them. It is the simplest idea, but it is very effective. And you can make something like this yourself, right? But it wouldn't be color coordinated, and you know Frankie loves her colors. Yeah, true. <laughs> true. Now it's kind of the easy button, you know. Yeah. It's really not that expensive um, either. They, well, they cost 40 bucks, which okay, yeah. I thought maybe was a little bit expensive for what it is. But, for yeah. plastic containers? Yeah, I guess you know, so after you After you buy them and use them, it's like, oh yeah, they're worth it. But what if you, you do, spend guys, one night sorting it yourself, you're like, I want to spend 40 bucks. Absolutely, <laughs> it's true. Okay, and you need uh -huh. you need a bucket, like a, uh -huh. uh, a five-gallon bucket like we have here. Yeah. They just sit in there. Okay. Um, we'll yeah, show so you what it's like. Grab some, grab a few handfuls. One more. I have a little. Okay. Okay. So then you take it. It's very loud. It's very, very loud. The pugs hate it. Even though they're in here with us. So yeah, there you go. Okay, so this is the first was, phase, you guys. This one. This will be uh, your 45 and maybe some bigger calibers as well. Now, every now and then, it's not perfect. You might get some uh, 9mm cases that get stuck in there, but this yeah. does a pretty good job. So then your phase two here. Okay, what are we left with here? Um, so this is mostly like the 40, 40 and then right? some weird miscellaneous stuff. You might catch like the occasional, uh, yeah, 38 or uh, mm -hmm. revolver caliber. Yep. So then, oh, see, look here. This one just fell out of there. Mm -hmm. 22, right? Very loud, though. Sorry, pugs. Um, and so what did what fell through? So then what you're left with is pretty much all your nine millimeter. But yep. of course you're gonna get your three eighties in there too, so it's right. not right. Then you kinda have to sort that. Yeah, yeah. But you're left with a minimum mm -hmm. of sorting. And but then what did go. we get here? We got a thirty two. Thirty two, yep. <laughs> yep. A little random guy. And then three twenty twos. Three twenty twos. Okay, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So these guys, they if you've ever sorted before, they save you a ton of work. Yeah, lots of work. As you can see, we've got some work to do. And yeah. this is after after you pick them up, this is the first step is sorting them, mm -hmm. and then the next step is to clean them. I don't recommend throwing them in the tumbler. 
unsorted because they stick inside of each other and then oh, yeah, they don't get clean pain, and yeah. yeah yeah so yeah anyway so sort we, then clean we thought we'd do a little uh -huh. video on yeah. the um yeah midway shell sorters i'll put yeah. a link in the description they work yep. very well very effective very effective simple and, uh, idea and one of those ideas that you wish you said i wish i thought of that yeah because yeah. it really is super simple and effective so yeah. absolutely well, thanks a lot for joining us, guys. We're going to get back to it and uh -huh. do some sorting tonight. And, uh, uh -huh. yeah. Have a nice little Saturday night. Yeah, Woo! it's, it's going to get wild, you guys. Crazy. <laughs> All right, thanks a lot for joining. Uh, join us uh, as a subscriber if you haven't already. Click yeah, that button sure. real quick and join our YouTube family here, and we'd love to have you. Yep. Thanks a lot to our existing subscribers who watched this far into the video, yep. even if you're into <laughs> reloading or not. You know, yeah, thanks yep. for joining us. All right, guys, we'll catch you next time. Bye.